Have you ever wondered what the best treatment for scoliosis is? There are a lot of treatment methods out there. Which one is the best? Hey, I'm Dave Butler and today I'm going to talk about scoliosis treatment techniques and what we're seeing in the research, a re current research article that talks about how we can get the best results possible from scoliosis specific exercise. So in this recent research article, this was uh, published in January of 2024, they, well the title is Physiotherapeutic Scoliosis Specific Exercise for the Treatment of Adolescent Idiopathic Scoliosis, the Systematic Review and Network Meta-Analysis. So basically what they're doing is they're looking at a bunch of different articles, uh, research articles that are out there and determining the effectiveness of PSSE or Physiotherapeutic Scoliosis Specific Exercise. So it's interesting because they actually looked at two specific PSSE techniques, the Schroth method and the C's approach. And their results are, are really interesting. As we read through, they showed that the Cobb angle and the angle of trunk rotation both improved with PSSE techniques. Uh, and they also looked at quality of life. And, and I, think, I think it's important to, to look at all aspects of this. A lot of times we get tunnel vision on the Cobb angle and that's not that doesn't tell the whole story we have the trunk rotation angle but we also have quality of life and that's important as well for all of our patients we want all of our patients to have good quality of life and it looks at at those things as well as the Cobb angle um, so the conclusion was really interesting the network meta-analysis showed that Schroth scientific, well, Schroth method plus the C's approach or scientific exercise approach for scoliosis was the most effective in improving Cobb angle and the angle of trunk rotation, while Schroth alone was most effective in improving the quality of life. So it's interesting that the Schroth method if we're looking at quality of life, that the Schroth method is more effective in the research at improving quality of life. But the combination of Schroth and C's is, is definitely, well, showing in the research that it's more effective than either one of those alone. So that brings up an interesting point. Which one is most effective and which one should you do? Here at Align Therapy, I've been doing the Schroth method and C's approach um, kind of mixed together a little bit for the right patient population for for a while now and and I do see that some patients respond better to the scientific exercise approach to scoliosis and some people respond better to the Schroth method and I think we have to individualize that but we can take some aspects of both of those and combine combine that treatment and it's an interesting interesting thought <clears throat> that Schroth plus the C's or C's, however you want to say it, from Italy is, is more effective. So here at my clinic, we do a lot of uh, Schroth method. We do, that's probably our main, our main method of treating scoliosis. But we do have some patients who can't tolerate the Schroth method or they're too young to do the Schroth method or the Schroth method exercises are too complex. For those, we can use the CS technique, the Italian technique, the scientific exercise approach to scoliosis. And we can use that to get better results for those patients as well. I think if you're a Schroth therapist or you're a CS therapist or you're doing some other form of PSSE, I think we have to be careful on just doing specific, one specific method for treating scoliosis. Yes, the Schroth method has the most research backing it. And I think it's important to know that and it's important to do, do that specifically to help, help our patients get better. But we also need to be aware of the other techniques that are out there, even manual therapy techniques and core strengthening and things like that. We shouldn't just focus on one method and stick to that method all the time, in my opinion. And this research article um, looked at that and it looked at, uh, you know, what what the benefits are. Schroth method, it shows improve the quality of life more. And this is with 857 patients over 17 randomized controlled trials. And so 
you know, keep that in mind. It's a lot of patients, but these are, this is just looking at different, different research articles. It's not a research study in and of itself. Uh, like I said, we do Schroth and we do C's here in the clinic, and we see great results with utilizing both of those. So if you are going to have scoliosis treatment, make sure you're doing something that has been researched and research backed, but also, you know, I would look at different things, Schroth method, C's approach, stuff like that. So it's cool to see that some research is being done looking at the combination of the two, because we've been doing that here for years. And I think we can get better results if we individualize for the patient and we treat according to that specific patient. So hopefully this was helpful. I'll put a link to the, the, um, the study in the description below, so check that out. And don't forget to subscribe if you like what you hear, and we'll continue to update you on current research, and we'll see you next time.